Thanks! Look! No training wheels! Skateboard trick! Speedy Sebastian Sebastian likes to move slowly. He wants to ride a bike, but is a bit scared to go fast. Maybe he can start with a tricycle. That was fun! But he wants to go faster. Maybe a folding bike? What fun! How about a motorcycle? He could ride a dirt bike. Sebastian is going fast. Wow! A rocket bike! The fastest bike in the world! Whoa! Phew! Okay, that was too fast. Maybe the tricycle isn't so bad after all. The end. Oh. <laughs> Dangerous. We're safe. Going downhill makes wheels turn faster. Scooters are so fun to ride. Dirty. Clean. Dirty. Clean. A bike chain is a long loop that connects the pedals to the back wheel. Purple. <laughs> <laughs> 
shoot, they score! Ready, set, pull! Kids work as a team and use all their strength and tug of war. Dad is trying to score, so he's on offense. The kids are trying to block him, so they're playing defense. Ready, set, go! Running is a fun way to exercise. All. B all. All.
It's challenging for ice skaters to bounce on one leg while skating. It takes many hours of practice to learn how to do that. Pond! Whoa! A beaver dam! inside an egg in the water. A tiny larva emerges. The larva has a yolk sac that contains food. The larva grows eyes and a mouth. Now it is called a fry. The fry has grown fins. It has become a juvenile. The juvenile starts to grow faster. Now it is called a smolt. A fully grown fish is called an adult. A female fish lays eggs. This is called spawning. A male fish fertilizes the eggs. All fish begin life. The pond race. Hans, Doug, and Finns are going to have a pond race. Darla wants to join. Everyone laughs. She is too small to race. Darla feels unimpressed. Ready, set, go! Darla starts off in fourth place. Doug is winning, so he thinks he has time to chew on a hockey stick. Now Darla's in third place. Hans pulls ahead, but stops to rest on a comfy lily pad. Now Darla's in second place. Finns takes the lead, but decides he has time to do some fancy belly flops. There's the finish line. Darla finishes first. Slow and steady wins the race. The end. Beavers love to build dams day and night. Try saying, busy beavers building five times fast. Lily pad roots. Beaver. Zero. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. During some seasons, ponds dry up. Don't worry, they usually fill again. All turtles begin life inside an egg. A turtle hatches from the egg. It is called a hatchling. The hatchling grows bigger. 
Now it is called a juvenile. Once the turtle is fully grown, it is called an adult. A female turtle finds a mate and lays eggs. My hamster is so fluffy. Be papa dabu, be papa dabu, be papa dabu. One hat. One bird swing. One xylophone. Four dog bowls. One dog kibble. Walsh Pony Bearded Dragon Lizard Mini Lop Rabbit Puppy Dog Kitten Cat Fry Fish Ferret, snakelet, snake. <gasps> Amazed, drowsy. Snoozy. Mm, pleased. <laughs> Sad. A pet is an animal that someone keeps as a friend. A good pet owner provides a clean home, food, water, and exercise. The vet is in. Harvey is a veterinarian, an animal doctor. Today is his first day. Robin comes with her pet hamster, Buttercup. Something's wrong. Buttercup stopped running on her wheel. Harvey checks her. He finds out that Buttercup is dehydrated. She needs more water. Buttercup feels so much better now that she is hydrated. Harvey's next patient is Ginger's fish, Bubbles. Her scales have a bunch of weird spots on them. Harvey runs some tests. 
and discovers Bubbles is sick and needs medicine. The spots are gone. Bubbles feels all better. Up next is Rosie with her pet snail, Salsa. She is worried because Salsa will not move from the corner of his tank. Harvey notices that there is lots of poo in Salsa's tank. He cleans it with a sponge. Rosie promises to clean Salsa's tank more often. Salsa dances around his clean cage. Jack visits next. Are you sick? asks Harvey. Jack says, nope, I'm just here for my treat. I mean, check up. Harvey checks Jack's bones. So, what about that treat? Jack asks. Harvey says, you earned it. Here's a sticker. The end. Let's go on a treasure hunt. A hexagon looks like a bee's honeycomb. A trapezoid has four corners. A square has four sides. A rectangle looks like a board. Zero, five, ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty-five. Treasure is something that is special and valuable. Some types of treasures are gold, gems, jewelry, coins, and collections. Zero, five, ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty-five. has five sides. A circle is made with curves. A heart means love. Circle looks like a taco. This is what a ruby looks like before it's cut and polished. This ruby gemstone has been made into jewelry. One, one. 
one, two, two. Scuba diver is looking for treasure in a sunken shipwreck. Do you think they'll find any? Let's go feed the animals. Onion plant. One, two, three, three blocks deep. Robin's farm friends. Cock a doodle do. Robin wakes up to the rooster crowing. It's a beautiful day on the farm. Robin puts on her overalls and heads outside. She has lots to do this morning. Robin starts at the chicken coop to give the hens fresh grain and water. She collects some eggs in a basket. Next, Robin milks the cows in the barn. She fills the bucket right to the top. Robin notices that the sheep are looking extra woolly today. It's time for a trim. She shears the sheep and gives them a brand new look. They feel much better now. Oink, oink. Robin hears a sound coming from the pig pen. What could it be? It's some newborn piglets. The mummy pig is taking care of her babies. Welcome, little piggies. To celebrate, Robin gives the piglets party hats. Snack time! Robin treats the farm animals to some watermelon. Then, Robin lets the animals outside to enjoy the sunshine. While the animals are outside, she cleans the barn with a pitchfork. Robin looks out over her farm and smiles. When the animals are happy, Robin is happy too. The end. Zero, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. A farm is an area of land used for growing crops and raising animals. Beach plant. One, two, three, three blocks deep. <gasps> Daikon plant. One, two, three, four, five, five blocks deep. Zero, one, 
zero. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, twelve. Corn grows on a tall leafy stalk. You can open an ear to find the corn cob inside. is the best. There's a class for playing games like kickball. PE class helps you build muscles and stay healthy. Eraser, 
eraser. D ask. D ask. Desk. K out. K out. Count. Teachers help you learn new things. It looks like the science teacher is helping kids learn about flowers. Let's make a splash. A fish is called a school. There are hundreds of snapper fish swimming in this school.
White House. Dolphins. Sea turtle. This ocean water may look clear, but it has salt in it. It also has tiny animals that are too small to be seen with your eyes. One side, we call this a waxing crescent. When the sun lights up half of the moon, it's called the first quarter. The waxing gibbous is when the sun lights up most of the moon. Yay! Now the whole moon is lit up by the sun. This is called a full moon. Uh-oh, there's a little shadow peeking in. It's a waning gibbous now. The shadow now covers half the moon, which is called the last quarter. When the shadow covers most of the moon, it's called a waning crescent. is what the moon looks like up close. The circle-shaped holes are craters made from rocks crashing into the moon. Four. 
usually see the moon only at night. But sometimes with the right light, you can see it during the daytime too. Sometimes we can't see the moon because it's completely in shadow. That's called a new moon. When the sun lights up one side, we call this a waxing crescent. When the sun lights up half of the moon, it's called the first quarter. The waxing gibbous is when the sun lights up most of the moon. Yay, now the whole moon is lit up by the sun. This is called a full moon. Uh-oh, there's a little shadow peeking in. It's a waning gibbous now. The shadow now covers half the moon, which is called the last quarter. When the shadow covers most of the moon, it's called a waning crescent. Look at all the flowers! All sunflowers begin life as a seed. When the seed has water and sunlight, it opens. This is called germination. A stem and roots begin to form. This new growth is called a sprout. The plant has grown some leaves. It's called a seedling now. The plant gets much bigger and grows a bud. The bud opens up and becomes a beautiful sunflower. An insect pollinates the flower so that seeds can grow inside. When the flower dies, the seeds drop to the ground. to grow. Bye-bye, weeds! Rosie's Garden Rosie loves growing vegetables. She loves eating them, too. She uses a shovel to dig. She uses a hose to water. She grows carrots. Wait a second, what's that? Is it a red pepper? No, it's Tom. He was sleeping on the ground. 
All that napping made him hungry. Growing vegetables is fun and delicious. The end. Watch this rose flower grow from a bud to a bloom. Ant. Pull ant. Pull. Pull ant. Plant. D. Ert. D Ert. Dirt. R Oot. R Oot. Root. Seed. 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 Woo. Woo.